Hi, I'm Stuart and welcome to Sirenet Television. Going to take a look at a siren amplifier and controller available from Sound Off Signal. It is part of a new family of siren amplifiers and controllers that are available here on Sirenet from Sound Off. So go ahead, of course, and check them out on the website for all the relevant technical specifications. But essentially, this particular model is known as the ETSA 461 HPP. It also has another variant, which is the 462 HPP. And the difference between the models are essentially one is a 100 watt and the other is a 200 watt. So again, that essentially differentiates those two particular part numbers. The control unit itself will mount inside the vehicle, and as you can see, it's a handheld unit, nice and compact. I'll just take it out of its holder. The holder has actually a magnet on the back, and when that is secured to the dash or the area in the vehicle that you wish to mount this, basically it slides in and stays in place. It looks like a microphone, so again, it's the sort of thing that'll fit very comfortably into your vehicle. And it has a variety of different push buttons that clearly indicate the functionality that you want this unit to do. So you have your standards one, two, and three, which are obviously clearly shown at the top there, tied in with an area here for the microphone, which I do press the button on the side here, will get the mic to work. And then in turn, you've got a variety of different additional push buttons available, which you can put a legend over, and those push buttons will then equal additional functionality in relation to the controller unit. That all ties into the box, the amplifier box, which I'm holding here in my hand. If I turn it this way, you'll be able to see here all the relevant connecting areas at the back of the unit. And they're all, of course, fused. Some additional technical information on this unit as follows. The actual rear of the box, which you're seeing right now, has got a variety of fused inputs. You've got a total of seven 10 amp inputs and three 20 amp inputs with internal fuses, which power uh, solenoids, which are inside here. So you have the ability also to connect a gun lock mechanism to this unit should you decide to do so, along with other devices such as a printer, radar, GPS, etc., can also be plugged in as well. Reverse polarity protection, always a handy thing to have, is available with this unit. The unit itself, as I said earlier, will either come in a 100 watt or a 200 watt variation. Now again, the box looks identical. The difference between the 100 watt and 200 watt is in the part number. The ETSA 461 HPP, which is what this one is, is the 100 watt and the 462 HPP is the 200 watt, but essentially they're in the same housing. Now again, on the website, there's of course additional information available, so go ahead and check that out. A really nice product available from the gang over at SoundOff, and it's available here on Sirenet. I'm Stuart, and thanks for watching.